In algebra, we call these like tens because they have the same alphabet. Meanwhile, this one, they are not like tens because they do not have the same alphabet. So in algebra, you can add this. Just add the numbers, then write down the alphabet. In this case, we cannot add because they do not have the same alphabet. Okay? Good. So the first thing we have to do is to collect like terms. That is, the ones that have the same alphabet, we write them together. The first one is what? 7AB. Which one has AB? This one. Carry it with a sign. There is a sign in front of it, so write it with a sign. Plus AB. The next is what? Is this. Write it with a sign. Plus 3A. And the final one. Minus 2A. So this becomes 7AB plus AB is what? Remember, they have the same alphabet, so we can add. Meanwhile, this one does not have any number. Automatically, what does it mean in algebra? It means there is one over here. There is an invisible one over here. So, 7 plus 1 is 8. Then, write down the alphabet. A, B. Then, these ones, they have the same alphabet, right? This is just 3 minus 2. Hmm? 3 minus 2 is what? Is 1. So we can write plus 1A or just write your alphabet. In algebra, we don't write 1. We just write the alphabet. Okay? Good. So this is our final answer. We can't add these because they do not have the same alphabet. Hmm? So let's collect like terms. 9e minus 6e plus 12f minus f. So this equals, they both have the same alphabet, right? Good. So 9 minus 6 is what? Is 3. Write down your alphabet. Plus 12f minus f is what that is plus 11 f this is our final answer so let's collect like terms 17 has minus 6s plus 9t and minus 2t. 17 minus 6 is 11. Write down your s. Then this minus this is what? 9 minus 2 is plus 7. Write down your t. This is our final answer. Did you get it right? Let's collect like terms. 20PQ minus 18PQ plus 8R plus 4R. 20 minus 18 is 2. Write down your PQ. 8 plus 4 is plus 12. Write down your R. This is our final answer. Did you get it right?